Hey guys, so I get quite a lot of questions on people asking how do we stop um, duplicate search results coming in in uh, your when you're extracting results from like LinkedIn Sales Navigator or just regular LinkedIn. So I'm going to show you how we do that. So this is the flow that we built in a previous video. I'll link in the description. So if you need to catch up to this point, you can watch that video and then come back to this one. Um, so essentially, all we would do is add in an Airtable module and we would do a search records. And then you want to make sure that we're connected to the same base um, that you had the record stored in previously that we're checking for duplicates in, right? And then under the formula, all we're going to do is use the LinkedIn URL because it's always going to be unique. So make sure this is spelled out exactly the same as how you have it in your database um, in terms of capitals and everything like that. Otherwise, it will throw an, an, an error. Um, so we'll do LinkedIn URL equals to and then we're going to take the uh, uh, we're going to take the URL from here. So and if we just run this on one example that we already have in the database, so it's going to return a duplicate. And what we want to do is say that we're going to filter it out. So if that if it returns a result for us. If ID exists, it means that they already exist. So uh, we, we want to make sure that we don't con continue with it. So sorry, we want to do does not exist. And then it will continue down this path. So I'm just going to change. This is currently set to extract a thousand um, contacts. So I'm just going to change this to just do like 10. So it's going to be much faster. Save changes. And then we'll just get it to run once. So if this has been set up correctly, none of these records that it, it finds will be added into this database because we, we've already processed all records in that search. So it's making sure that no duplicates come in. Cool. There we go. So that has stopped the records from going through. So then what we'll do is we'll actually change up the search a little bit just to make sure that the logic is working. So these records haven't been added into this database before. So all of them should continue to go through. So because they don't exist in the database, they're all being added. So that is just a simple filtering system. Search for the record based on the LinkedIn URL. Filter it out. If, if it returns an ID, it means it exists already. So then we, we don't want to continue with it. And that way, if it doesn't exist, then it's going to be added. So that is how to make sure that you don't keep adding duplicates into your database. Um, as always, thank you very much for watching. Um, like you can schedule this to run as frequently as you want, like every day, however often you want to do. Um, any questions, yeah, feel free to, to leave a comment and I'll get back to you.